Tonight, the Hidalgo County District Attorney is looking into allegations of animal cruelty after receiving letters from concerned citizens. Action Force Ashley Custer has our report. This one and a half year old pit bull pup was given the name Aries by Justice for Mutts. Aries had to be euthanized due to poor conditions and several health complications which exclude him from treatment. It was very heart rendering to see that somebody had allowed an animal to progress to this point. And uh, it was it was obvious neglect uh, or, or ignorance or both that had led to this. Veterinarian Gary Gosney said not only was the pup dehydrated and emaciated, Aries also suffered from generalized demodectic mange, pyoderma, an overwhelming case of heartworm, and had a necrotic pressure sore on his chest. He had tissue, and so it rotted out the, the, the skin and the muscle down below, and it was just an open sore that had, was, uh, had been there for a, a good while, maybe one or two or three weeks. Aries was brought to the attention of Ed Couch Police by an Austin resident visiting her family in the Rio Grande Valley during the Labor Day weekend. Action 4 News obtained a copy of the incident report, which states that when the owner was asked about the animal's condition, she told the officer, quote, doing the best she can to get her baby better, but the vet bills were getting pricey and she could not afford it, end quote. Then telling the officer that she even went to Mexico to get medication for the dog, the owner then agreed to let the complainant take the dog, saying, quote, that's fine with me. I just don't want to have to put my baby down, end quote. Ed Couch Police concluded their investigation into the matter and no arrests were made. Well, obviously we, we got phone calls here to the office and um, as soon as we became aware of the situation, um, we, um, we, we, we decided to send some investigators out there. And District Attorney Ricardo Rodriguez couldn't go into detail as he says it's still an open inquiry that his office is investigating, but he does tell us... If you have an animal that, uh, uh, or a dog or a cat, whatever it might be, if you have some animal that you've become attached to, uh, obviously um, you have to know when you have to become detached of that animal uh, to not put it in, in a difficult situation where it's a matter of life or death. If you don't have enough money to treat an animal that's getting sick, you can always take it to an animal shelter or to a, a, a group that takes care of animals and they'll take it from you and they'll either treat it or put it to sleep based upon what, what they see at the time. So, I mean, there is no reason for an animal to reach this stage whatsoever. It is totally and completely inexcusable. Ashley Custer, Action 4 News. The DA says his investigators discovered other dogs at that Ed Couch home, but they appeared to be in good health. He says his office will likely make a determination on this case by the end of the week.